I'm Jimmy Atherton, and welcome to Healthy Moments. This is a show where I catch you up on all the best health-related articles in the news. Today, I got to do a Roadrunners event, so let's get this party started. First up, a new drug that reduces the risk of sexually acquired HIV. About 50,000 people a year catch HIV, and about 240,000 people in the United States don't know that they have it. The name of the drug is Truvada, and it has to be taken every day. The annual cost is about $14,000 a year. Now, comparing that to the $600,000 cost of lifetime management of full-blown AIDS, it turns out to be about half the price. I read through this article a few times, and I didn't have any info on how the drug works. For more information, link is in the description below. Next up, we have an article on Alzheimer's. Now, there's a lot of drugs out there that help manage disease, but there hasn't been much progress in preventing the disease altogether or reversing its effects. Gamagard is an intravenous therapy used to treat many immune disorders and has found promise in reversing the effects of Alzheimer's. 5.4 million people in the United States have Alzheimer's and it's the sixth leading cause of death in American citizens. <laughs> Lastly on branded news, not exercising is just as bad for you as smoking. It turns out that 10% of the annual deaths globally are due to inactivity and stagnant lifestyles. The funny thing is that most smokers develop an exercise phobia and days after they quit end up going straight to playing basketball, sports, or heading straight to the gym. Regardless, I was a smoker for 16 years and the day I quit I started running. This not only made me feel better, but it caused a chain reaction around my friends and my family to also quit smoking and adopt a healthier lifestyle. That's it for this week. Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Plus. show me some love and subscribe. Maybe you'll catch you on a game of poker and Google Hangouts. Stay healthy, wealthy, witty, wise, and I'll see you next time.